I would yield one minute to the gentleman from Washington, Mr. Newhouse. Thank you, Mr. Jordan. The gentleman from Washington is recognized for a minute. Thank you, Mr. Jordan. Madam Speaker, this is a sad day in our republic, but not as sad or disheartening as the violence we witnessed in the Capitol last Wednesday. We are all responsible. My colleagues are responsible for not condemning rioters this past year, like, like those who barricaded the doors of the Seattle Police Department and attempted to murder the officers inside. Others, including myself, are responsible for not speaking out sooner, before the president misinformed and inflamed a violent mob who tore down the American flag and brutally beat Capitol Police officers. Madam Speaker, we must all do better. These articles of impeachment are flawed, but I will not use process as an excuse. There is no excuse for President Trump's actions. The president took an oath to defend the Constitution against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Last week, there was a domestic threat at the door of the Capitol, and he did nothing to stop it. That is why, with a heavy heart and clear resolve, I will vote yes on these articles of impeachment. <laughs>